Love that music. We are back now with our Ray of Sunshine series, celebrating hometown heroes across the country. And this morning, we're shining a spotlight on a yoga instructor who provides accessible classes for everyone and has started a cycle of giving back in her community. In yoga, it's important to find your center. But for many on the square in West Palm Beach, yoga instructor Jade Wanzo is their center. I'm so glad that all of you are here. From the very moment that I met her, like I just, I was like, I have to give you a hug. I, I tell everybody, come see Jade. You gotta see Jade. And there's one thing we keep hearing about Jade. She looks like me. She looks like me. For Jade, yoga is for everybody, all shapes, backgrounds, and all abilities. I don't have the thinnest body, and I can do just as much as anybody else. Not to mention, there's not a lot of black and brown yoga instructors. Whether they can do every pose or not, I like for them to come and just feel comfortable in their bodies. Don't worry about your neighbor or what they look like, just worry about you. A yoga instructor by trade, two years ago, Jade started holding weekly classes outside, which for some, like Rebecca Diggs, can be more comfortable than in a traditional yoga studio. My previous yoga experience, it was very fit, wonderful, looking individuals and I didn't necessarily feel like I fit in and here in this space with Jade I definitely feel like I fit in in exactly who I am and to make it even more accessible the classes are donation based traditionally in a yoga studio classes can be anywhere from you know 18 to 25 dollars for a drop-in for some people that's the difference between gas to work or picking your kids up whatever people can give just give and if you can't give it still come to class I don't want you to miss just because of that. And rather than keeping that money, she spreads her sunshine by paying it forward, donating the money to this nearby children's bookstore, Rohi's Readery, which shares a familiar theme. It's really cool to read a book and see people that look like me. And just like Jade, the owner, Pranu Kumar, shares a mission of access and inclusion. Every single book in here is reflective of historically marginalized communities, whether it is Black, Indigenous, LGBTQIA+, disability. We want to make sure that stories are seen, valued, and that there's always a sense of belonging and empowerment. When I come here, I'm like, I want to have every single book in the bookstore. <laughs> So far, Jade has donated more than $3,500, which goes towards books for underserved communities. I gave and then she does a good thing and we hope it just continues. And to further that cycle of giving, our friends at lifestyle brand Aerie are sending Jade a little gift. Stop it! <laughs> what? A basket of fitness gear plus 50 $100 gift certificates for her to spread even more sunshine around her community. Clothes are honestly part of accessibility. You know, sometimes people won't come to a class if they feel like they don't have the right pants or if they don't have this or that. So like being able to give this to them, that's gonna be amazing. I'm really excited. Thank you guys so, so much. Jade, for stretching out your heart to others, you are our ray of sunshine. Wow. So well deserved. Mm -hmm. I love that circle yeah. of giving. It just continues and continues. Beautiful. It's beautiful. Oh, nice.